Well, I was born in the inner city, um, and my parents uh, were living at the corner of Hall Street and San Jacinto. Both of them were highly entrepreneurial. They owned their own little uh, dry goods store at the corner of Rawson Hall, and my parents uh, operated that store for about 45 years and took care of three generations of families. And I got exposed to so much there, and my mother, was an excellent saleswoman. That's really where I learned to take care of the customer, was watching her. And it really served me well in the real estate business. I wasn't a particularly good student. I, I was uh, always very active in doing all these other things, and uh, sports being one of them. And college was not a question. It was just where I would go, and there was only one place I could afford. That was Texas University. So uh, we, I went down there and I came out with an a undergraduate degree in business. College was uh, really not, not very easy for me because I was doing a lot of other things, uh, playing sports and involved in, in politics. And, but it was all helping me grow and broaden me. And I think too many people today stop growing and, and don't challenge, don't push the edge about their personal growth and I work with people a lot on that. I feel that I, I grow every day. When we're interviewing, I, the first question I ask young men, do you have a passion? And, and too many don't. Too many have not made a decision about what they want to do, what they want to be. Someone that has a passion has a spark in their eye. And I, I can pick that up real quickly. If I was in school, the Junior Achievement Program would be definitely something that I would be drawn to. It rounds out a young person and helps them with guidance and coaching and mentoring to stay on the right path, uh, learn that they can make something of themselves and, make their, and, and grow. And you know, growth is what it's all about. I tell people today in my company, we can't sit still. We have to continue to grow. That's one of the tenets of our lives is to continue to grow and and it could be in any area but if it's in your vocation you have a much higher chance of greater success. I'm going to say to all these kids that are in junior achievement that they're very fortunate to have the opportunity to be part of the program. It's going to make you a better person and you're going to really learn what you need to do in life, because life is very complicated. And the younger you are to start learning, the better. And I think Junior Achievement is there for you and gives you that start.